Now at 604, former South Florida Congresswoman Ileana Rosslayton is now under federal investigation about the misuse of campaign cash. Federal investigators are now looking into whether the recently retired representative misused that cash for herself. CBS 4's Brooke Schaefer is live in Miami with exclusive details about the investigation. Brooke, good morning. Hey, Maribel, good morning. This exclusive reporting coming from our Jim DeFeedy here at CBS 4. As of this morning, I can tell you some of her former staff members have been subpoenaed to either provide records or appear before a grand jury. This is all regarding tens of thousands of dollars in spending. At issue is a bank transfer of more than $177,000 from Ileana Ross Leighton's reelection campaign to the IRL PAC, a political action committee she controlled. The transfer was made after she announced she would not be seeking reelection in 2018. Federal law says campaign money cannot be used for personal use. A review of expense reports shows a series of questionable expenditures, including nearly $4,000 spent on a family trip to Disney World in December 2017, of which Ross Lehnan posted a photo to social media. Other expenditures include more than $10,000 on rooms at a New York hotel, nearly $6,000 at the Ritz-Carlton Resort on Amelia Island, and another $28,000 at the W Hotel on South Beach. On New Year's Eve 2018, just days before she left office, she spent $3,100 at Mesa Mar, a high-end seafood restaurant in Coral Gables. Ross Leighton's campaign spending was first reported by Noah Pransky on the Florida Politics website last June. Following that news report, the Campaign Legal Center filed a complaint against Ross Leighton with the Federal Elections Commission. The complaint alleges there is reason to believe that IRL PAC violated federal law by converting contributions for personal use, including a family trip to Disney World and tens of thousands of dollars of expenses at luxury hotels, none of which have any apparent connection to Representative Ross Leighton's candidacy or duties as an office holder. A spokesperson at the FEC declined to comment on the status of the complaint. The Justice Department is also investigating. Ross Leighton's attorney, Jeffrey Weiner, says the former congresswoman is aware of the investigations. In a statement to CBS4, Weiner wrote, quote, she and her former staff members and volunteers are cooperating operating fully with the Federal Election Commission and the Department of Justice. We are gathering the information requested by the Department of Justice and are confident that if bookkeeping errors were committed, they were due to negligence and not willful or intentional misconduct by the former Congresswoman or anyone on her staff or her accountants. Ross Layton declined to be interviewed for our story. Maribel, I can tell you that typically these FEC investigations are handled administratively. Candidates return the money and then pay a fine. But if it's a more serious case, the FEC can then refer those allegations to the Justice Department for criminal prosecution. I'm live in Miami. Brooke Schaefer, CBS4, this morning.